guys, I take every week coming to you with another video on the iPad Mini. Uh, I'm going to do a Geekbench uh, speed test here. Uh, well, it's actually not a, um, a speed test. It's more of a, a hardware test, like an overall hardware test of, uh, of everything there. So what we got here is the iPad uh, 2 uh, 5, which is, of course, the iPad Mini. I'm um, running iOS 6.0. Um, iOS 6.0.1 is out, but I did not upgrade to that yet. Um, and the processor is the ARM V7 and about 1,000 megahertz there. And the memory is about half a gig. Let's go ahead and run the benchmarks here. I actually previously ran it already and I got 750, uh, but I'll run it on video here and see what we get. Uh, and actually on the uh, the Geekbench uh, benchmarks, like all of it, when they're listed on the Geekbench site, uh, it showed the iPad mini at 730, I think, or 731 or something like that. And I did get 750, so uh, I don't know why uh, they have it posted as that. I don't know if maybe some people have been getting uh, lower readings or if you have apps in the... Um, the multitask switcher uh, it may actually lower it uh, but I got about 750 again so I don't know why they have it posted at 730 uh, actually let's go ahead and check that out now uh, in Safari so if we zoom in uh, we got iPad mini right here and it's got 731 um, but I have got 750 as you've just seen I got a 749 there and um, I just did one test previously to this and I got 750 you can see right there uh, and to compare it with some of the other um, some other main devices out here. The iPhone 5, uh, it says 1570. Um, so it's, um, it's about half of that. Uh, but then to compare it to the iPad 3rd uh, generation, uh, which it's actually surprised me, um, the iPad 3rd generation has the A5X processor, and that only got uh, 791. That's the uh, the base model there, iPad 3rd generation. It got a 791, so that's pretty close to the iPad mini, which actually surprised me. Um, but of course, the iPad 4th generation is way up there at 1752. Um, in the Geekbench app here, uh, you can get plenty of different information about the system the, and a whole bunch of different kind of performance stuff here uh, you can look through. Uh, it is all uploaded on the Geekbench website. I believe you can access any of the stuff here uh, and check out some of the readings. I'm not sure. Actually, maybe not. I'm not positive on that or not. But they basically give you tons of different information, uh, a lot of in-depth information. But the overall score was 749 here. Uh, but that's it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I'd appreciate a like down below. Uh, if you'd like to share the video, you can hit that share button as well. And if you want to see my future videos, go ahead and subscribe up top. I'll have more iPad mini videos to come. And uh, I'll have jailbreak updates for iOS 6. Uh, if you guys are jailbreakers, um, I'll, I'll push out some uh, some progress updates. Uh, so if you guys want any of that kind of stuff, uh, go ahead and subscribe up top. And that'll notify you when I release those videos. But that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you later.